And since we know a place to go, let it snow, let it snow, let it snow. Good morning, Kev here, and I am in Sailorsburg, Pennsylvania at the Blue Ridge Flea Market. And uh, all right, it's not gonna snow, but 48 feels like 20 when you're used to 80. Like, look, I'm wearing these, I forget what they're called. Oh, clothes, I'm wearing clothes with sleeves and pant legs. It's very weird feeling considering I've been in a t-shirt and shorts for the last uh, three months. But anyways, I'm here, it's brisk. I'm gonna start walking so my fingers don't get numb and let's go find some treasures. Neil O'Donnell. Cost, cost us a Super Bowl. Stupid Steelers. I was thinking about getting one of these. Uh, well, I'll say it's for my son, but it's definitely going to be for me. Let's be honest. Just got to make sure my uh, health insurance is up to date. Alright, there you go. Like I can stand to use all the change I got. What you get for the telephone? Man? I was asking for Yeah, that was funny. Yeah, that stuff too. It's kind of neat. Cake. Lots of, lots of people here braving the weather. That's awesome. What what time frame do you think this is from? Pretty old. Double decker. With the original wheels. All original. Those those usually uh are, are you a YouTuber? Yeah. Those are usually those are usually rotted out, no? That's crazy. <laughs> What, what, do you, what do you get for something like that? So, yeah, try to get a hundred bucks. That's not, you know, that's not out of the question. You won't, you won't see one that doesn't need a wheel replacement. Yeah. That one's not too bad. Does this thing still work? Oh yeah, I just put batteries in it. Yep. Oh my gosh. So hopefully what I love that original patina. I wouldn't do anything with it. Yeah, I it uh it, it this is a newer clock, see? Oh, the inside like there. Like a ho Hobby Lobby type oh, so thing. It's a, yeah. Oh, I was That's fake. the reason we probably yeah. bought it 10 years ago because it somebody, looked, somebody looked it older than it was. Yeah. Definitely. I was full. <laughs> I'm, yeah, so I'm, looking, I'm looking at all the vintage stuff and I, I would have been, you could have told me it was uh, 100 years old. I would have. Yeah. You would have got it. her home, opened it up, and oh, man. Oh, my dick. <laughs> yeah, I would have been. Uh, I would have been out 50 bucks or whatever. No, we're looking no. like 10 bucks on it. Bucks on it. Well, yeah, I guess because you're honest. Wow. You're a gauge guy. I got hundreds of them. That's crazy. There's like, build, there's like, to build steampunk there's like a whole, yeah, there's a whole uh, yeah. Yeah. underbelly that like loves yeah. this stuff. And, uh, oh, we, we had a blast and, and cool. we made a killing on it, but we're in the process of cleaning out the house and getting a motor home and going on a five year road trip. Oh my gosh. Take so. me, take me with you, please. <laughs> we'll find us some campgrounds to work at. Wow, this is awesome stuff. It's a really impressive collection of salt and pepper shakers. My gosh. Christmas, some stoves. Random creepy animals and kids, but that's neat, man. Yeah. Very 
Beautiful. Oh, stop for patina, man. What's the rest? That's cool. I barely see these parts. Frank or Hazelton. We need to have a matching set. It's in pretty good shape. <laughs> I'm gonna sneak attack Mr. Taco's uh, stuff while he's not here. See if there's anything I can steal. Oh man, I was hoping you weren't gonna be here. I was gonna, I was gonna steal something, and then see if you noticed it. And then come back next week, watch the video. Well, yeah, mine are on time delay because you know I, I can't do it every day. But I would have given you the money eventually, probably. That's neat. Hats. I thought you do, you don't do online with the hats, some of them that are uh, yeah, more collectible. I go them, I pick the ones I like, and I sell the ones I don't like. And they bounce around. You're selling papers? That, that's... Yeah, that came from the auction yesterday. And, uh, she didn't want it, I didn't want it. I was going to say, if you didn't offer it at least. <laughs> wow. That is cool. Well, so much for stealing stuff. What am I gonna do with it though? But yeah, I'm gonna have to sneak it into my garage so my wife doesn't see. But yeah. They they know they they can they she can, my wife's probably still sleeping and she just like she can hear a ringing in her ears right now. I'm gonna I'll take those. Wow. What uh, what do you what do you get for the fixed up ones? Like I, I, I um, that's honestly, really... I paid thirty a piece. <laughs> you pay? I, oh, you paid up for them? And I paid four. I bought four of them. I kept two that I like. Okay. Two smaller. Right? Were they all different colors? Like yeah. look at that. <laughs> it's such a neat idea. That's oh, kind of neat. Fixtures, that's me. Well, I'm gonna buy some myself and think about doing a project. And I gotta visit the vast amounts of iron this guy takes. I'm not finding anything today, which means one thing you're, get, you're getting it all. Ah. Uh, how are you making out? Where, where, where's your assistant? Oh, he got walking. Ah. Oh, you got him doing the. No, he did walking. Ah. The birds got hit real bad this week with moisture in here. Oh, no. And it rushed it every fucking day. Yeah, the uh, the the hot cold, hot cold. Like well, sometimes I, I get that in my garage. I hang one of those fucking. Uh, what are they called? Yeah, that's, that's a big one. Damn Newer. Bags and when I came down on Saturday, it was full of water. Oh no. So I had to change it out, but it was too late already. Huh. 
want Megan off road. All right. I always appreciate it. Oh my gosh. But none of it's anything special, you know? Three, five, eight. Waffle iron action. I do not love the the waffle irons are my least favorite to uh, fix up. Yeah. Yeah, they're not fun. Hammer. Long pack action. Wow. No gate mark. Yeah, fucking. I played junk off yesterday. Oh, man. Yeah, that's funny. I only got five more weeks. Oh, yeah. Not... yeah, I know. It's uh, I couldn't believe walking walking out of my door and I had to check the weather for here because I'm an hour south. What a difference. I, I had to walk right back out and put some actual clothes on for the first time this season. An, what, what hour, a, an hour ago, you couldn't see the fucking mountain. It was all foggy, I know, oh my gosh. Ugh. I'm trying to uh, infiltrate Renee's area, their favorite tote man. These chairs. They do love the saws. I was already looking through the records. No uh, classic rock stuff I like, but. Very cool. Books, magazines, just so random. It's hard to do it. I don't know how she does it though. It's hard to dig around this stuff with one hand. She's a pro at it. And I obviously have a lot to learn. Yeah, I gotta put you folks down and get in here. Something definitely died in there, but I do need a trap for my neighbor. He has groundhogs. So, I might come home. Pretty, pretty impressive. Uh, well, how much was the knife? 35. 35. 40. Okay. Very cool. Real nice shape. Did you fix these up yourself? Real nice, man. Yeah, but they're all beat up and then I take them all and keep myself busy. Well, no, it's, <clears throat> excuse me, you can definitely, uh, I appreciate the de rusting, man. That's the hard part. Yeah. Real nice. All right, made it back from uh, Blue Ridge. Um, I have my. New Jersey it's 76 and humid outfit on as opposed to the one this morning where it was 45 and slightly windy it definitely had to turn around and redress myself so I need to stay stay ahead of these things but anyway I had myself quite a little day uh, pretty good showing with the vendors lots of shoppers too but I don't really care about them I want to I want to be the only shopper there but Quite a little haul, I would say. That's a uh, gate marked large griddle alongside a smaller unmarked Wagner. A little Griswold, no lid, and this is a mismatched trivet. That's actually a uh, Volrath. A trio of big boys, T number 12s, 14 inch approximately. Um, are you even allowed to say big boy? I don't know. Like, 
if you're over 40 and you have an opinion, uh, you're basically canceled. So it was nice knowing you folks. This is a five and an eight of the Fight Starter Birdsboro. It was sold by Birdsboro, not made by them. Make sure you know that. A couple threes. That looks like a uh, Good Health three by Griswold. That's a Volrath. And a uh, Wagner. Got a Wagner unmarked right there. Talk about talk about Two Face. Look at this. Favorite peak will wear number nines. Pretty similar looking, except yikes. I definitely have my work cut out for me there. I have to look this bad boy up. I thought it was a Pfizer wear. Uh, under further inspection, it says Husqvarna, which is, uh, yeah. I mean, they, they make my lawnmower, but I didn't know that they did uh, enamel wear. So, I have to check that out. Got a trio of Wagner squares of different sorts. That one I'm going to have to look up, like, some kind of, I don't know. It's going to be like a plat type Swedish wooden boot pancake type thing but we'll check it out who doesn't need pulleys like come on this thing is ginormous my gosh and two little ones of course i have to buy a phone when they're cheap because you know hello yes yes ten thousand tesla i don't care make it happen boom done hey and a couple, couple uh, Pyrex. Scored these because my boys get bored on any road trip. It's longer than like 10 minutes, so we could watch these in my truck. And a couple choppers. I'll have to look up the name on that, but that one has some. That one has some girth. These are light, still handy, but. Anyways, that's my. Uh, that's my booty. That was. Uh, you know, it was worth it. It was worth waking up at 4.45 and having it be in the 40s. It was crazy. It's hard to uh, adjust. But um, anyways, hope you enjoyed. I know I did. Um, I might have woke up my wife on the way out. So I have a feeling I'll be on the couch tonight. But that's all right. It's a nice breeze out there. So anyways, as always, this is Castor and Kev. I think we'd all do better. Starting with me. I need to use those things called weather apps and uh, prepare for uh, fall a little bit better.